God bless. Amen. Amen. Hey guys, Evview's here. I'm here at my local Raising Cane's and we got, um, what was it called? Leprechaun Lemonade. All right, Leprechaun Lemonade. I have to keep it sideways. Um, we got the squad, we got Guardo, we got this guy, we got Dope, and we got- Go! We got, um, all right. Leprechaun Lemonade from Raising Cane's. Let's try it. That's all right. Damn. Oh, Chad, it kind of tastes like lemonade. Like, okay, it kind of tastes like Let lemonade. But, um, wait, I gotta give it a review first. Just tastes like normal lemonade. No leprechaun flavoring in there. Um, but it's a good lemonade. Five out of seven. But pass it to Dobe. Hey, guys. Dobe Swanson here. And I just want to say, there's something so nice about seasonal foods that, you know, I don't want lemonade. When I came here, I wanted sweet tea because I love sweet tea from Cane's. You feel me? But there's just something so nice about... There's just something so nice about seasonal foods at Cane's that like... Not even Cane's. One time I got Captain Crunch that turned my milk green for Halloween. What? It was gross because my milk was green. But you know what I did? I ate that whole box because it was seasonal. It's the same marketing that, you know... Frankenberry and, and Count Chocula used okay, to okay. boost their sales. Up, and I just couldn't resist. And I think, you know, that's what makes it worth it. So, you know, come on down to your local Raisin Canes and get some awesome Dobe Leprechaun Lemonade. All right. Oh, this song is definitely All right. Copy, Thank right? you, Dobe. Um, just for that, I'm bumping up 5.5 out of 7. Like, yeah, seasonal stuff. You gotta love it. I wasn't getting lemonade either, but when I saw it, green lemonade in the back, I was like, I gotta get that. Anyway, that's all. Have a have a leprechaun-tastic day. And uh, yeah, empties out. And dope everywhere. Yep, dope <laughs> everywhere.